Alright guys, we're doing Thank You for the Music by ABBA today. This was a, a hired request and I'm using sheet music for it that I was provided with. So I'm going off the sheet music for this from the person that hired me. It sounds like this. for this song or on my website webpianoteacher.com you can find me on Facebook or Twitter uh, Facebook is a good way to get in contact with me uh, if you like custom DVDs of some of my lessons just the lessons you want um, seancheekblog.com is a place to get that I also have some sight reading DVDs if you'd rather read regular piano music notation I have uh, DVDs for that as well but let's get started with this free part one so again, I'm using sheet music for this, okay? Thank you for the music. And I'll, I'll just kind of specify that because I'm, I'm not going off a, uh, the album. I mean, I'm sure this is taken from the album version, but I'm not listening to an album version and writing. I'm, you know, I'm using what was provided to me. So this is uh, in the right hand, E, G sharp, B. And so we're going we're gonna to have the melody in the right hand, which is typically what you get when you when you use uh, sheet music for these things, which a lot of people like that. They like to have, have that melody there in the right hand. But E, G sharp, B is first. And then we're going to do another B, then another B, and then B flat, A. So it's bum, 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 bum. We're going to have a lot of sharps in this. This is in the key of E. At least it starts out in the key of E. It will change and go to the key of F in a bit. But uh, So we're going to have lots of sharps, four sharps. And then we're going to change to C sharp and E on the right hand. And then we're going to have a G sharp by itself on the right hand. And then the last note is a middle C sharp. Okay, so if we just do the right hand here, it's thank you for the music. So this is not part of the melody. This is just, you know, a chord filling in for that beat there. Okay, so thank you for the music. Alright, in left hand we have an E. The music just has a single E, but you can do an octave. It would sound fine, it would sound good there. And then here we're going to an F sharp uh, octave if you want. You can do the single note if, that, if that's what you like. Alright, so if we, if we line up both hands for this first box, we have Thank you for the music. Okay, so don't play this too loudly because it's not melody, okay? Just let it be there. Next box we have songs I'm singing. That's going to be A and E together. And then we're going to have A and D sharp. Okay, and then singing is going to be G sharp, B, and F sharp on the top. Play that together. And then we'll go to an E. So left hand's on a B. You can do a B octave if you like. It's still not. Uh, I need my marker. I left out a note. Put a, an E here. It's in red, but there we go. So B and then E. So this measure would be songs I'm singing. So we start at the beginning and put those two measures together and go. Thank you for the music. Songs I'm singing. Now right, we go to the next box here and it's going to be Thanks for all the joys there. actually went two boxes there but so on the right hand first we have G sharp middle C sharp and E now that chord is not part of the melody it's again another one of these it's just a chord to fill in the beat there and you sing on the D sharp thanks for all okay but play that first chord not too loudly and then D sharp and then C sharp, and then we're going to have G sharp, C sharp, and D sharp. Okay, so uh, G sharp, C sharp, D sharp together. 
you hold that just a bit and then you end with an E. Okay, so just the right hand right here is thanks for all the... Now the left hand's got a C sharp, you can do an octave again. Then left hand goes to a B. Okay, so put hands together and we have thanks for together. Two, ready, go. Then here we're going to have joy they're bringing. That's going to be, let me play it. <laughs> joy they're bringing. So joy they're bringing is going to be F sharp on the bottom, middle C sharp, and then G sharp on the top. That's a bit of a reach there. If you can't reach that, you can just kind of roll it like that. If you can reach it, just play it all together. And then an F sharp. And then a B and an E together. And then a D sharp. So the right hand right here goes, joy there, bring Alright, and then the left hand is just going to have an A sharp. We do an octave here again, if you like. Or just a single note. And then B. Line them up and we start here and go. Joy Let's do it again. Joy now let's start over and go that far. Two, ready, and go. Then I have a dot to dot, which is this thing right here, dot to dot. And all that means is that you're going to repeat from the dot to the dot. <laughs> so it's just simply repeating one measure. So let's repeat that measure starting right here from this dot to this dot and go. Okay, and that's who can live without it, I. And then, then we change. We go to this part right here that's going to go asking honesty, asking all honesty. So ask will be C natural, not a C sharp. In the music it's actually written as a B sharp, but I just put C for clarity. C and then an E together. And then we're going to have a C and a D sharp, which is this, C and D sharp together. And then we go all on S, D. So that's going to be C sharp and F sharp together. And then an E and an F sharp and a G sharp. So right hand here is ask and will be a G sharp and an F sharp together. And then moving up to C sharp and G sharp together. And then just a B right here. Okay, so put hands together slowly right here. It goes S and S D. Let's do it again. S and S D. Notice that these are together. Right there. Bum, 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 bum. And then right here we're going to have, let's see, that would be, or that, uh, what life would be, what life would be, and that's going to be right here, C sharp and E together on the right hand, and that is not melody, that's just again a chord to, to fill in the beat there, and uh, and then what life would be. This part right here is what life would be, which is F sharp, and then an E, back to F sharp. And then at the end there, we're going to have C, and then an E natural, and a G sharp. It's an augmented chord. Okay? Uh, <clears throat> left hand will just be on an A. Right there. So you play the A there, and one, two, what life would be. Now do count to two when you play this. board and finish it on the website but let's start back here and tie these two measures again together starting here uh, ready go see how that works make sure you count to two there um, now let's start with the dot to dot thing because that'll kind of make it um, the, the whole phrase work so let's start at the dot to dot and then I'll finish out the board so here we go Ready and go and who can live without it? Ask and honesty. One, two, what life would be? And then the next board. 
comes up. I hope you enjoy it. Talk to you later.